I think the school district is going to have a whole series of uh, diversity focus group and workshop. And I think uh, they had uh, one um, last semester, and there were about like 60 parents attending. Mm -hmm. Yeah, wow. and then uh, and people share about uh, experiences and all kinds mm -hmm. of uh, diversity experiences. And I, I think there are a lot of things they need to do. And I, th I think they have started by training the staff, yes. and, and which is a very yes. important uh, step because I would think that earlier in the school district, all the racial or sexual um, uh, discrimination issues tend to be handled as just bullying, like mm -hmm. anti-bullying, yeah. but mm -hmm. it's actually not. One is bullying is bullying, then there's the Title IX, there's the Title VII, yeah. there are all different categories, and, and that also affect um, the regulations of how student records are stored, because oh. if you, uh, yeah, because different, I, I think the state uh, recommendation and regulation is that if it's Title IX cases, it's going to be preserved way longer than anti uh, bullying cases. So there, oh. so there are differences that how these things should be handled differently. Know. Yeah, and I think it is a very, very low awareness overall in general, yeah. not just mm. uh, in the community, but mm -hmm. in, the, because because sometimes it's like students don't know they could report. They no. don't know what to report, and then the the staff and the, the you know they are all pretty well meaning, but they don't really understand mm -hmm. what involves. And so I think at least they started by training the staff, and then uh, they also took the high schoolers to see the Schindler's list, mm -hmm. which I think is a great to mm -hmm. understand. Um, it, it's a whole school field trip to understand all the historical forces mm -hmm. and what had happened, mm -hmm. because I think a lot has to do with, you know, knowledge about the racial Absolutely. histories. And so mm -hmm. I feel this kind of education is really important about why you cannot do or say something. It's not because of of oh because it's not because of why you can't but there are reasons mm -hmm. so for a while yeah. it was it was really cool to make fun of the holocaust like to laugh about it and to make jokes about it that was really cool for some reason at, across the united states actually recently <laughs> and <Okay. laughs> some of our high schoolers have fallen into that just from ignorance like wow. education right. is just so wow. important and we don't take for granted that staff and um, that school staffs are on board with tolerance. That, and, you know that a lot, some of them are equally ignorant and racist. Yeah, so, I wasn't aware you know. that that was happening. Mm -hmm. And I feel like I stay on top of current events and what's going on yeah, in my yeah, community. Too, and so I'm like, wow! I'm again blown away that that's happening. Wow. Yeah, but I think there's another component too, right? There's tolerance is getting to is is person to person, right? Because I think there are a lot of things that I would not be aware of without the fact that my family is a diverse mm -hmm. family and a multiracial family, and that my circle of friends is diverse. And I think part of it is that like when people are aware of each other on a person to person basis. Mm -hmm suddenly like making a holocaust joke mm -hmm. maybe that's not cool right or mm -hmm. making fun of someone's hair okay like right that's not okay like mm -hmm. you learn what's okay and not okay by being friends with by knowing other people exactly. and knowing people that are different from you yeah and i think mm -hmm. where you know getting back to school where our school district actually does have a golden opportunity is some of the changes mm -hmm. that are coming yes ahead, that are coming and that maybe that provides an opportunity both for the policy and the practice but also some of the person-to-person -person stuff mm -hmm. because I think that maybe some of the yuck in the high school and the middle school is because people have like kind of formed their social identities in these somewhat segregated groups mm -hmm. and when they come together it's like well there's some things that have been crystallized mm -hmm. right. and I do I do think that there's a component of punishing bad behavior, but I think there's also a component of encouraging good mm -hmm. behavior. Mm -hmm. And when I get really frustrated by what people are doing or ignorant things people are saying, I try to kind of come back to, okay, like, there's a way to make this positive, mm -hmm. maybe. And sometimes there just yeah. isn't, but... We have to I try. Don't know. Gotta try. Yeah, it's yeah. an education yes. business, right? Yes. Just yeah. how That's about right. trying education? Yes. Yeah.